Yeah, welcome back to my actually first tutorial on some off-topic stuff. Yeah, I'm now going to show you how to make your own scale armor. It is that simple. It really is so simple you might actually ask why I'm doing a video about it. And well, because I love videos. <laughs> that's, the exp that's probably the easiest explanation for it. So basically what you need is obviously scales. I'm using here some 4 by 4 centimeters scales which are exactly weighed 15 grams. I didn't even know the manufacturer used or yeah wrote something on it. Actually I didn't know about it so yeah, that's actually quite a, quite useful. So yeah, they are, uh, they weigh 15 grams and are of I think yeah they are made of high carbon steel, which is tinned. I think I think they're tinned. No, they have a, a pretty hard zinc coating on it. Sorry, they have a pretty hard zinc coating on it. So they don't rust at all, really. Can leave them in. Well, salty water and even then, they don't rust at all. So, let's get started. What you need? You need, obviously, two pair of pliers. I use one big and one smaller. You can use, obviously, two of them or two of them, but I prefer to hold the ring. Yeah, you need, or you also need a bunch of these guys. They are... 8mm uh, chainmail rings which are normally closed like this yeah you can see it yeah it focused quite well they're closed like this and basically again you just I hope I can do it on camera yeah you just basically you just open it like this then you get four scales Put them together in one package. Yeah, I'm doing it off camera now. And put one of those rings through it. Use your two pliers and close the ring like this. And that's basically all you need to do. Then just use your or you just use the 4x4 package and spread it open like this. Now that's your structure. You always want to have your body armor or something else. Oh, and a syringe dropped on the floor. Bloody cats. Well, you basically want to uh, make a scale armor like this. So if any weapon or not only weapons, also it is better to wear like these or, or like so. So, if you have a uh, scale armor and wear it like this, actually the weight of it presses them together. If you wear it like so, it doesn't only look quite bad, but it actually drives them further apart. So, it doesn't only look garbage, it feels garbage, and you have no movement. Really, it really restricts your movement, so be careful if you <laughs> if be careful not to mess it up. But back to topic. You need quite, actually quite some of these uh, 4 before packages. I made some. Oh yeah, I think at least 50 of them. Yeah, I have no life. But I made already my scale armor fin uh, I already finished my scale armor I think four years ago yeah something like that oh no 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 four years ago I started building my leather armor which I never finished actually bloody scales pop apart yeah that did stick together quite well actually so again Use it like so and turn it correctly. Then again, get one of, get one ring. Oh, 
open it like so. Then you basically rinse and repeat, you just put them through like this and through like this. Then you close it and yeah, maybe a little, it's a little bit open so yeah, now they're closed. So again. And after this you have rinse and you have to rinse and repeat so again get for the four package of scales and now you have to be careful because you don't want actually you don't want them like this because yeah obviously it's bad you want them like this so again, just get your just get one ring, open it, and usually put it through like so. Oh, like so. Sorry, I'm a little bit sloppy on camera because it's actually really hard. I only have a small table and a teeny tripod. You can actually see the feet of the tri uh, the foot of the tripod here, well, leg of the tripod. Sorry for mispronunciation. And again, you can also see if a uh, yeah table is pretty thin. It is only uh, I think 12 millimeter thick plate. So actually, it's pretty bad. And I know this this ring is not closed, but for the sake of the video, I'm doing it actually pretty quick. So don't get bored too much. And again, just get it right, turn it right over, put it through like this. Oh, sorry. Put it through like this. Put that scale over here, and yeah, not going further like. Oh, it does obliterate, yeah. It's a cheap Chinese. Half pliers, I paid probably two euros or something for it. So again, it is closed and basically, as I said a couple of times, you just rinse and repeat. And yeah, after some time, you get a pretty much uh, you get your scale armor. And also, it is pretty damn flexible. One second, I can show it to you. So actually, it is. Quite flexible. I use it for leg armor, uh, especially. The originally, my thought was I use it for some sort of leg armors, and then I came out. I use it just for, yeah, just for body armor. It really looks great. I uh, think I can cut in a picture of it, so I hope I, I hope I can do it. But yeah, basically, that's it. It is really dirt, dirt simple. It is just incredible simple. And also I put in some links in the description where I, at least I in Austria did get it over this supplier. I hope if you are from, I don't know, the UK or something that you can find some other suppliers. Maybe I'm going to find someone, but at least I put some links in the description and so we can check them out. If you are in Germany or somewhere in Europe, you can order for them. I think some of them, at least one supplier, does international shipping and where from this, the seller where they get the scales from does also of international shipping. Yeah, the, all uh, both of them where they get my stuff, they both offer uh, International shipping. There, I get the rings from another supplier and the scales from another supplier. But again, yeah, put the, uh, I check out the links in the description. I put them in there uh, so you can check them out. Both both uh, of uh, international shipping. Yeah, I did check. I actually did check it right now on my phone and put them in the description. Check them out and yeah, basically hope you enjoyed the video. The Robert is 
some sort of lame video. Again, thanks for watching. Bye.